I'm sorry the lighting in this video like keeps changing. I'm really, really, really sorry. Hey guys, so first off, I got my hair cut and it's really short. So today I'm going to be doing a video on Black Up Cosmetics. So basically, this company sent me all these products and they sent me a lot of products first of all. They're very, very generous. Thank you so much. If you go to their website, you'll see a lot of um, women with darker skin um, colors using these products. So they did send me a few things like face products that were a little too dark for me because, you know, I'm like the color of paper. But anyway, what I'm trying to say to you is even if there is a company that specializes in colored people like like darker skin tones or olive skin tones or whatever, um, you can still wear their products. Like their darker foundation, I can wear as a contour, you know? Um, just try to make things work, but don't limit yourself just because it's not for your skin color, you know? So first to start off, they sent me a foundation, and this is in 3HA, I believe. Oh, this is in O2. I'm not sure if they have a lighter one. This is very dark on me, um, but I'll just swatch it right here. See how, like, caramel this color is on me? So as you can see, that's pretty dark, but it's beautiful. It is a beautiful foundation. I mean, I still put it on my face um, to, just to try it out, and it looked like really flawless. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I wish it was my color, but again, I can contour with this. Even if I do client's makeup, you know, it's really good to have a lot of different shades because not everyone is as pale as a ghost like me. It will control your oils and everything, and you don't have to worry about like blotting your face like I did today at school for picture day. And then they sent me another foundation, and this is a uh, full coverage cream foundation, and this is in HC01. And again, this one is a little bit dark on me as well. Um, not super bad, but I mean, probably would have been good more towards the summer, but again, it's still pretty dark for me, but I personally like this one a lot better. I think this one covers a lot more, and yeah, I just really like how it applies, how it's like nice and creamy. I mean, it is a cream foundation. Okay, so then I got sent this Black Up Contouring Stick, and it is in 01. And basically, there is like a highlighting concealer side, which is again, is a little dark for me. <laughs> Everything's pretty dark for me, but I still use the contour side. So that is what that looks like. It's just like something you put underneath your eyes to just brighten everything up. And then the darker side is just a really dark cream product. And it's that line right there. Yeah. So this stuff is really, really nice too. Blends super easily. Like, ready? Look at that. I barely touched that. You see? It blends so nicely. Okay, so sticking to face products, I got two blushes, and this one is in 09, and it's like a sparkly coral color. This is in 09, and it's kind of like a burnt orange color, as you see right here. Super pigmented. I love this color. And then this one is in 08, and this is like orange. Like it's like a nice shimmery glitter orange yellow color comes out more yellow again I probably use this for an eyeshadow um, because it's it would just look really weird on my skin tone I think it would look amazing on darker skin tones but for mine it would probably just look a little weird so then I received two eyeliners and I got one in uh, black KS01 is the black one, and it these eyeliners are so smooth. Ready, watch. Barely gonna touch. Barely touching. It literally glides on. It's awesome. Um, and it's waterproof too, which is really good for me because my eyes get super, super watery for no reason. Um, but yeah, this stuff is really good. I've actually worn this out and it stays on. So, And then I also got this purple color as well. And this is in... SO5 and again barely have to press and see how beautiful that is so then I was sent so then I was sent this beautiful eyeshadow palette and like I'm not kidding when I say 
I literally don't have eyeshadows like this. This is what this palette looks like. And I have close-ups and everything, but this palette is amazing. I love how they have like neutral colors and then they have like a little splash of color. So you can either wear a neutral look or you can go out of your comfort zone a little bit, which I love. I love <laughs> On that shot and they scoring touchdowns on your runway. I'm sick as forever like Bobby and I'm Rambo and yo. I'm really a rich like John Jack. I'm okay, so then they sent me four individual eyeshadows, and I have two blue ones here. This is in 12M and this is in 11M. And then I have an orange and a purple. This is in 2M and then this is in 7M. I'll show you how insanely pigmented these are. Like, what the hell, bro? These eyeshadows are so good. I'm not even kidding. I'm not even just saying that. Like, they're good. It is beautiful. And I'll, you know what's weird? A lot of purple eyeshadows, matte purple eyeshadows, are very chalky. And these, they're all matte. Um, they are not chalky. I'll swatch this dark blue as well. It's kind of like a bright royal blue. Swatch it right here. And this light blue, it's like a baby blue, I'm running out of, here I'm on my hands, see how beautiful and vibrant, a lot of matte eyeshadows are just always so chalky and they're never pigmented and these are, and I love these. Okay, so the last eye product that I received was this, um, I don't know what this is, it's like a pressed eyeshadow, it's kind of like the L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadows, I think they're called. And this is in 04. And it's just a beautiful, like I'm I'm not kidding when I say beautiful. This is such a beautiful color. This taupe shimmery color. I love this and I know I'm gonna use this in one of my smoky eye tutorials soon. Okay. So next is on to lips, and the first thing that I got was this crayon 2-in-1 lip pencil, and this is in Oh, it's in Jump 07, and it's like a hot pink. I'll swatch it like right here. It's beautiful. It really is. It's, it's so pigmented. We love me in the morning. Yeah, yeah. So then I got this lip gloss as well, and this is in 12, I believe. I think it's in the color 12. But it's such a beautiful color and like it's so pigmented too and it's like a little squeeze bottle. So you squeeze it out and it's like a baby pink color. I'm just trying to explain it. It's like a kind of like a bright baby Barbie doll pink, right? It looks beautiful on. Beautiful. I'll just show you really quick. It's just such a perfect like nude pink color, but you can like make it really calm and like pretty if you want. And the last few things I got were three lipsticks and yeah, these are the colors. I have this nude one in O2 and I'm just gonna swatch these ones like here. This is O2. It's like an orangey nude color. I don't know why I'm like moving out. These colors are beautiful and they glide on like crazy. This is in the color 18. It's like a really bright orange red color. And they're sheer so they're not too like in your face. They could be if you wanted to but you would just have to kind of apply it like twice. And then the last one is in um, 37M which is a bright pink as well. Um, but yeah, they go on super smoothly and they're awesome. Yeah, definitely check out Black Up Cosmetics. Thank you so much for sending me this stuff. And I'm so sorry it took me a while to get this video up. I just kind of been stressed with school. But yeah, I hope you guys like this video and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye guys.